the system. It has always existed, as old as the dusty plains where we first settled. It will always exist, until the universe expands to its limit. It is as ancient as the darkness and as immortal as wickedness. It is not one of us, but it contains all of us. It cannot be stopped, but it walks among us. Of course it does not have a mouth, but everyone hears when it shouts. It screams, this is the way of the world. This is how things are, because this is how they always were. This is the way of things, and of people, and of living. No, the system is not a person, but it uses them. They may feel the force of it. They may collapse under it. They may run from it. Some may even fight it. It is not even always felt. It can be quiet and deliberate, lying about who is in charge, about what is in charge. But everything is a part of the system, and its existence relies on this submission. The system was created, but it is not manipulated. It runs because it is managed. The manager has been from worlds both civilized and savage. They have been man and woman. They have worn a crown and wielded a baton. They have borne the stripes of generals. They have donned suits made for business and garbs for the clerical. But nobody is truly in charge of the system. Not every victim even knows they are a victim. The enemy of the system is the revolution. This is no faceless monster devoid of emotion. It has many faces. It does not always walk, but still it reaches the furthest of places. It crawls, rolls, runs, or skips. The revolution is never quiet. It screams with a thousand voices, each belonging to a different generation of revolutionaries. They tell us what can be, that the world is nothing but possibility. The revolution is not one of us, it is all of us. It is the Iroquois, the Shawnee, and the Cherokee, painted faces fighting an invading army. It is Bass Reeves and Frederick Douglass, Sojourner Truth with her Bible and Nanny with her cutlass. But it is even older than them. It is 300 Spartan soldiers screaming at an army that they have never before fought real men. It is a shepherd boy who would be king, wielding a slingshot against a giant and winning. It is the will of the first man, woman, and their children to survive being cast out of paradise on just the slim promise of heaven. No, the revolution cannot be managed but it belongs to us. It exists because the system exists. It is here because we summoned it.